Welcome back to GMA3, everybody. We are very excited about our next guest. And, and check out my next guest. Now, she has two music degrees, a PhD in geology. She was a civil servant for NASA, a scientific co-investigator of the 2020 Mars Perseverance rover mission, and currently working at Carnegie Institution for Science, but she's here as our Faith Friday guest. This will all make sense in a second because of her duties as rector at St. Albans Episcopal Church. There she is, Reverend Pamela G. Conrad, or most people call you Reverend Pan. Thank you so much for being here. And I reeled off some of that resume there. So tell me, what is your first love? You go from music, geology, some science, some space, and the clergy. So what's your first love? Love is expansive, right? So <laughs> it doesn't matter what came first. Oh, I hear you. That makes perfect sense then. Well, you have that science background and you've done, well, look, the work with NASA. And, but you're also, like I said, you're, you're, you're the head now. You're the, the rector there at St. Albans Episcopal Church. Some people think that sometimes science and, and religion don't go together. They're in conflict in some way. How, do you think that's the case? Do they need to be reconciled in some way? Many people do see differences between disciplines, but I see connections. And I think seeing the connections enlivens everything that I do. And I hope that will be true for you and for others as well. Wow. Now, you, I do have to ask you, because we had so much space news, I guess, uh, recently, the, a bit of a space race, a billionaire space race, some would argue. But still, we just saw the, the Blue Origin, that company, Jeff Bezos, uh, uh, go up and make that trip uh, earlier this week. What, what do you make of what we are seeing now with, um, I guess, some just call it billionaire joyrides, a billionaire space race, but you see some benefits. I do see benefit. I would much rather have someone privately paying for space exploration mm. than rely upon governments to do so. There are so many ways in which we need to expand our portfolio of expertise on this planet. And so whether or not somebody initially has as a motivation to explore for adventure, ultimately we will all benefit because the expertise will elevate the state of the art and we will be able to include more and more people. Well, ma'am, while we have you here, of course, all of our Faith Friday guests, we ask for some guidance and words of encouragement, and a lot of people need them. We're, we're dealing with pandemic, we're dealing with drought, we're dealing with so much out there. So I'll let you have the floor, some words of encouragement uh, and hope going into the weekend. You know, life is so full of not just threats, but also opportunities. And we hear so often about the threats we forget how much opportunity is embedded in our ability to make choices. The power of one person to do good is so much more profound than any one of us realizes. So take the time to make the decisions that you can make a difference. And whether it's the weekend or the weekday, enjoy the heck out of it because your life is yours to choose and you can do good and you can feel good no matter what else is happening. Reverend Pan, I love it. And you should see our studio crew here. A lot of them are nodding their heads and even putting their hands in the air. That was a great message that's right on time for a lot of folks. So Reverend Pan, it is so good to see you. We will see you down the road, okay? Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.